Good morning, good morning. Come on in and let me know if you're around. If you're catching the live or the replay, it's equally as good. Just let me know with a little hashtag so I can come back and chat with you. And hopefully that's the notification gone out, so we're getting much quicker again these days. Good, good. <sighs> so I'm looking forward to seeing who's about this morning. It's a much pleasanter day, if pleasanter is a word. Hi Lizzie, good to see you. Much pleasanter day this morning. It's not raining. It's There's some blue in the sky. It's very pretty. Hi Paula, good to see you. Thanks for joining. Hi Madeleine, hi Adele. Lovely to see you ladies. How are you? Woo, okay. We have a very keen card this morning. Good morning, Lizzie. Hi, Sharon. Good to see you. Howdy, Lisa. How are you today, darling? Hi, Patrice. Lovely to see you. Good morning, Paula. I can see the wabbits too. I can see one of them. I think there's about six when I last... Oh, and another pair of ears just at the bottom of the step. I can see two. I swear they peep up and watch what we're doing. Good morning, Jenny. Good to see you. Oh, okay, we have a jumper. <laughs> it's gone in the sink. Okay, listening, definitely listening. Good morning, Tanya. Good morning, Tracy. How are you doing? Hi, Donna. Lovely to see you. How is everybody this morning? Hi, Louise. It's great to see you too. Let me just grab a drink, actually. I am thirsty this morning. Good morning, Lisa Ann. Sucking up. Oh, bless you. Good morning, Tanya. Hi, Jenny. Good, 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 good. Plenty of, plenty of happy smiley faces there. Good morning, Natalia. Okay, so let's get cracking. I've got two lovely cards for you today. You've just seen me uh, shuffle and they are jumpers. So it's a strong message for us today. Um, and if this is your first time to the page, you are very welcome. My name's Emma Johnson. I'm the Inner Smile Coach, and this is the Daily Tap. So what this is about is it's for me to show people how to do emotional freedom technique um, to feel better, no matter what's going on for you, to take a bit of control back over your emotions and so that you're not trapped in them, you know, essentially on this page. There's lots more it can help with, but essentially for the wider general public, that's what this is around. So if you're feeling frustrated, overwhelmed, anxious, a little bit down in the dumps, or you just want clarity of mind and a little bit of peace and and um, and happiness in your day, then this is a great thing to do to start the day. And I always say to people, tap on everything. Tap as much as you can, tap in the morning, tap before you go to bed, make it a routine. And this is why I'm doing it every weekday, to try and help you get in the routine. Hi Doreen, good to see you. Double tap today again, fantastic. Right, so the decks are very dedicated, Sarah. Hi Anne. Messages of life and power of surrender. And we've got two lovely cards this morning. The first one is simplicity. So if anybody is feeling overwhelmed, frustrated, hi Juan, good to see you, thanks for joining. <clears throat> then this is about simplifying your life and releasing your burdens. Hi Helen. And then the how card, if you like, the second card, how we're going to do this is by surrendering frustration. Good message, right? Hi, Helen. So let's just do the tapping, shall we? If you've never done this before, all you need to do is tap where I tap and say what I say and see how you feel. Okay, so if it helps you to gauge that whether there's been a change or not, place your attention on any area of, let's say, tension, tightness, discomfort, any pain you've got going on in your body right now. Place your attention there before we start this and then place your attention there afterwards and see see what's happened it's magical okay now the caveat is that you've washed your hands um and not been out since and, and not washed your hands because we're going to tap on the face okay but if you if you haven't just stick to tapping just below the collarbones in that little dip there otherwise you can tap along with me so two fingers and please take full responsibility for your own well-being that means that if you have deeper stuff please see a practitioner if that's me great if that's not me great but please just be careful of your own emotional well-being okay so take two fingers and we start here on the eyebrow point so if you go up the side of your nose it's just where the eyebrow starts today i choose to simplify my life and i'm itching already <sighs> outside of the eye so just on this bony ridge here as i do so my burdens lighten <clears throat> under the eye I release my ego's need to understand under the nose to prove 
and to control. Chin. Instead, I undertake every task. That's just in the crease there. And then we drop to the collarbone. So find your knobbly bits, drop down about an inch, there'll be a little dip. Tap under there. Uh, with an open, humble heart. Under the arm. So three to four inches down the side of your body, pretty much where a bra strap would be if you wore one. Seeing through the eyes of a child. You can also do it like that. Top of the head, all around the top and the back of the head. I discover life in all its wonder and simplicity. Then we go back to the eyebrow. As the complications and chaos of the mind fall away. Outside of the eye, I remember I am one with the light. Under the eye, frustration doesn't open any doors. Under the nose, the key to resolving a dilemma. Chin, or dissolving a block. <sighs> Collarbones, is to take a breath. Let's do that now. <sighs> Under the arm. Uh, sorry, stay here. Centre myself and regroup. Under the arm so that I can approach the situation more calmly. Oh, buddy, we'll be going in a minute. Top of the head. Today I choose simplicity by surrendering frustration. Let me finish on the third eye. So be it, and so it is. All right, take a nice deep breath. Now place your attention back on that area of tension, tightness or discomfort. Hi Sandra, hi Andrula, good to see you. We're just finishing, but uh, if you choose to watch the replay, let me know what you think. So how is your area of pain or tension? You know what we looked at before we started, Place your attention back there and just see if you were grading it out of 10 now, how painful would it be? And has it changed? There's very, there are instances where it wouldn't change if, if it's very severe or if there's something emotional that needs to, to be dealt with, but it's very, very unusual that somebody wouldn't have had a slight shift or a feeling of relaxation. And that's because we have regulated the nervous system and we've sent out dopamine and serotonin into the body, which are natural painkillers and make you feel all floopy. And speaking of floopy and floaty, Floaty Friday is this Friday. If you've never been to a Floaty Friday, it's an hour long, possibly an hour and a half, because we're actually having a celebration this Friday. We're going to have bubbly wine, whatever you want to call it. We're going to have a drink. And I do usually say don't drink while tapping because um, it can dehydrate you. Um, but, typical, but this is a big celebration. So Mandy Middleton is doing it with me. It's Mandy's birthday. It's my four year anniversary of doing the Floaty Friday and that's how this tapping journey started on this Facebook page. Um, wonderful, lots of results coming in. And it's also my last day of PAYE employment. It will have been that day and I wanna celebrate it with you. So yeah, big, big changes, big changes, lots of celebration. So if you wanna come and join me, it's eight o'clock on Friday night, Floaty Friday. Bring a glass of something gorgeous and if you don't drink that's fine too bring a cup of tea or some water and we pull a card for as many people as we can get through in an hour to 90 minutes and then we all tap together and what you find is that a lot of the cards are relevant for everybody because we join energy as a group um so i hope that you'll join me for floaty friday bring some texas bourbon absolutely lisa something you can sip something you can sip we're not aiming to get plastered <laughs> but you know just just to raise a glass and Toast the changes and all that. Shoulder tension reduced. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Um, you're very welcome, Lizzie. You're very welcome. Sharon, looser now. Fantastic, Lisa. Well done. Tummy fluttery and tight. Much more relaxed. Fantastic. You're welcome, Adele. Nine to a seven. Good work, Lisa. That's really good. In two rounds. That's really good. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a momentous day. Thank you, Sharon. 
Happy Floaty Friday. We'll see you then, Anne. Fantastic. We'll be there. Yeah, thanks, Madeline. It's it's time, my love. It's time. So I'm kind of, I won't say I'm retiring because I'm still going to be working at this full time. But uh, yes, it'll feel like retirement. So um, I hope to see you there. There is an invite on the page. I will be sharing it. So feel free to invite your friends, get loads of people there. Although, you know, if there's 80 of you, we won't get through everybody's cards. So we'll, if there's more than 30, 35 of us, then we'll pick, we'll just have to pick carry on through the list and then if we get to a certain point we'll just have to pick names at random or something like that because it gets to the point where we could be on there all night um sipping bob and fantastic okie dokie i'm gonna go and walk, walk pooch he's uh <laughs> he's mooching around and he's waiting look look at this he's waiting really patiently look at this are you a good boy are we going for a walk <laughs> i thought so good lad so i will see you again tomorrow on the daily tap Lots of love. Bye for now.